Good morning, Greyhounds. My name is Linnea Parrish. I'm your new SGA president. Would you please stand, stop, and face for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great Greyhound day. All right, as uh, she mentioned, that was Linnea Parrish, and that is your SGA student body president. And uh, each morning she'll get on here and get us started with our days with the uh, Pledge of Allegiance. And welcome, Linnea, to the new year, and congratulations on being elected into your office. All right, guys, it is Wednesday, and uh, today's bell schedule is a little bit adjusted. And, you know, sometimes we laugh about this, but uh, the reality is we try to do what's best for you guys at the beginning of the year. And uh, this uh, bell schedule, I know it's changed for the first three days, and tomorrow we actually will get into a flow. But first, today, um, your bell schedule is as follows. One, two, pause period, then three and four with your lunch based on your fourth period, and then five and six after that. Um, for those of us on the Seminole Connect option, uh, just make sure if you go on our website or go on our uh, social media pages, the bell schedule times are posted on there. They're also available in your Skyward uh, Message Center as well for you to be able to know what period is happening when and when your lunches are. We will get on um, the announcements. The only time we're going to get on the announcements today is before lunches, just to remind you of where to go during your lunch periods. Um, so be looking ahead and be looking at your one-way hallways, be looking at uh, everything that you might need to know as you go through and navigate this day. I'm sure your teachers will um, help you and prepare you as well, but uh, just want to make sure you knew that we're only going to get on the intercom one time today, and that would be right before the lunches. So exciting news, uh, we've got sports conditioning for a few of our sports is kicking off today. Um, and those of you that are on campus and those of you that are in Seminole Connect and watching live on our, uh, our live feed on YouTube, um, any students, whether you are here or whether you are on the uh, Seminole Connect or SCBS option may participate in sports here at Lyman High School. So that being said, today we are kicking off with two of our sports teams. We've got volleyball that's gonna be meeting behind the gym and our swim team that'll be meeting at the pool today. And, uh, and then tomorrow we've got football that'll be starting um, there. It's not practices yet, it still is conditioning at this point, um, but they will be uh, meeting starting tomorrow with football. So those three sports for sure. And I believe there are some other fall sports that have uh, been uh, communicating with their teams about uh, some extra conditioning workouts and such. Um, and we'll get further information as it becomes available. But again, anyone can participate as long as you are a Lyman High School student through SCBS or through the Seminole Connect option. Seniors, uh, we just sent an email out uh, to remind you of the information that you will need for Senior Parking Painting Day, which is this Saturday. The um, painting day is from 8 o'clock to 1 o'clock p.m., and uh, there was information that has been put in the Skyward Message Center. So if your email is not uh, coming through to you, you still can access it in the Skyward Message Center portion of uh, your online access. Friday, students, Friday is the last, and I wanna say it again, the last day to make any request to your schedule whatsoever. Um, we will be continuing today if you have a hole in your schedule, or if you are a hybrid student that is coming on campus and has a back-to-back -back feel um, not feel, but back-to-back -back classes, or you don't have back-to-back -back classes with being on campus than off campus, uh, today is the last day for us to take care of that. If you have a hole in your schedule, please report during your class period that you have the hole. And if you have any schedule change requests, you can either go online and fill out the request form, or you can go to the student services office during lunch to uh, make that request and sit with your counselor. But again, Friday is the deadline. All right, um, other than that, uh, just a clarification for our sports teams before you go out for conditioning, please do make sure that you are cleared to practice. Again, you must be cleared to go out to conditioning um, and you can do that by visiting the athletic clearance website, which uh, can be found on our athletics page of our own website. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, conclude our announcements here for today. Um, I wish you all the best. It is hope day and it is time for us to kick off first period. I hope that you have a great Greyhound day. 
All right, Seminole Connect and virtual students, um, just continue to, to monitor um, our uh, emails and everything else that we're sending out. We'll try to keep you in the loop with everything that's going on here on campus. Um, I do want to remind you that starting tomorrow, um, the bell schedule is slightly different. Um, and, and not when I say slightly different, it's, it's gonna be your bell schedule for the rest of the year, but do make sure that you're connected in with your, your teachers. Um, and as we move forward, we will continue to um, do these announcements. However, the format, um, the format won't change, but the time is gonna change. So we do our announcements during third and fourth period. When you look at the bell schedule, third and fourth period um, is around, I think it's 9.06. And so um, we won't be on first thing in the morning, but we will be on to give you all the other announcements like we normally do on a, a TV announcement schedule here on campus. We'll do that at nine o'clock each day. Hope all is well with you and I hope that you have a great Greyhound day.